Muskie fishing is big business in Wisconsin, and the bigger the fish, the better the business. Currently, Michigan and Wisconsin are working together to give the Great Lakes spotted muskie population a much needed boost. Today we're harvesting muskies for stocking in the Fox River and other points in Green Bay. These muskies came from Michigan about 10 months ago and we've been taking very special care of them and hoping to rebolster the population in Green Bay. The state of Michigan, who we're working in conjunction with, they took special care to go out and take eggs from as many females as possible and they kept all their families separate at the Wolf Lake hatchery and then Wolf Lake in an agreement with the Wisconsin DNR um, gave us surplus muskies for our program here in Wisconsin. DNR fisheries biologists are working to increase the size and population of fish in the Great Lakes and also to create a sustainable source of eggs here in Wisconsin. We're trying to accomplish two things. First was yesterday we stocked inland broodstock lakes and the hope is in the future we'll be able to go into those lakes and get spawning muskies and get certified disease-free eggs from those muskies, which will be great. The second phase is getting more genetics out in the wild for the spawning populations in Green Bay. If muskies can raise their own out in the wild, all the better. After a year of careful rearing, more than 9,000 muskie averaging about 14 inches will be released in both Inland Lakes and the Green Bay area. While releasing the fish at a larger size means greater survival, keeping them over the winter at Wild Rose comes at a cost. This is a huge undertaking to keep fish to 14, 16 inches in size. We couldn't have raised as many if it wasn't for help from the Muskie Alliance and the Muskie Clubs in the state of Wisconsin. Just last year that we, we donated $20,000 to the Wild Rose Hatchery here for overwintering these fish because uh, when you overwinter them, they have a better chance of survival. I am pretty proud of what we have accomplished here. The, to have the fishery we have right now, it's probably one of the finest in the United States. These fish and these programs have proven successful and create exciting opportunities for anglers. So far this has been a very successful program, at least on the angling side. Our anglers are seeing and catching a lot of large muskie on Green Bay. It's not unusual for uh, to hear stories of anglers catching two or three fish that are over 40 or 50 inches in a single day of fishing. While stocking these yearlings creates an exciting opportunity for Wisconsin anglers, the overall impact on our local communities is far reaching. Economically, this fishery has a huge effect, not only here locally in Green Bay, but up and down the lower bay, from Marinette all the way down to Green Bay and then back up to Door County. It's a triple win because it's good for the economy, the muskie, and the local environment. Green Bay has become world renowned as a trophy musky fishing hotspot. The potential of a new world record is there in Green Bay because of the huge water, the abundant forage, and because of the muskies that we're stocking now. It's a tremendous success and we need to keep it going. That's, that's the main thing, that's what we're doing here. We're ramping it up and trying to keep things going. We're trying to keep the anglers happy. To find out more about muskie in Wisconsin, visit dnr.wi.gov and search muskie.